Hey, what's up guys? Anil here from MotionMax. Here I am back with another exciting tutorial of Fractal Noise uh, Tutorial 2. Uh, you may have missed my Tutorial 1 uh, using Fractal Noise. Uh, I made a triangle transition. Uh, I explained deeply about the Fractal Noise uh, uh, using that technique. So please look up for that Tutorial 2 if you, are, if you have missed that tutorial. And Please uh, look after part of my portfolio. Portfolio. If you you may not see, uh, know me, I'm uh, I, I'm my name is Motion Max. In video hair. I'm an author for over five years in uh, video, hair and I made okay. lots of uh, templates uh, around uh, 70 templates around. So please look after for those. Uh, so it will support my channel uh, tutorial. So right now, let's make a composition of toilet into 720 name it as tutorial ok and drag the footage as it was in 1920 1080 I am going to shrink it down up to scale down up to by the way this uh, footage I have uh, I have been using here is, uh, uh, is from the test master which is a great uh, foot, uh, footage uh, other uh, in video have uh, I definitely recommend his portfolio for if you are using stock footage um, for the business or everything. He have a large portfolio of almost uh, is the number one other in uh, he is in number one position. Uh, so please look out for his portfolio too. So let's go for the tutorial. So by going first of all we need to make a vignette using a solid. Make a solid after all I need to say I wanted to make a composition size and uh, by selecting this uh, vignette we can name it vignette or you can go to right click or rename like that rename like that vignette ok so by selecting vignette layer double click on this elliptical tool so it will create a ellip ellipse elliptical mask so subtract and make it uh, up to the 150 to 200. Up, you can make 252. It's up to you. So it will make a nice vignette, and also make a make this um, by making an adjustment layer. Go to color correction, tint, and make it 60 percent or 50 percent. It will make, it will give you a nice look of uh, old film. And also go to color correction curves, make adjustments to the red channel, drop down and make a green channel, drop like that and also blue. It will make a nice vintage feel uh, in the footage. Okay, and uh, let's the game begin right now. It's a uh, making dust and sketch over this video. So by making a solid layer, we make a sketches right now. By making a solid layer, go to noise and fractal noise, and uh, make it uh, soft linear, and uh, go to transform and uh, turn up the uniform scaling and uh, scale down scale width to 2 and uh, scale the height to 10,000 so it will make a horizontal lines now play with the contrast and brightness so we can get a minimal lines so I am going to use like this scaling ok it will create a some of the lines only so some of them is not like this so here we have done with this uh, thing as we have the lines we need to animate it so we can see it by clicking on evolution button you can go to uh, by the way you need to put the complexity to 2 so we we get minimal length of full lines full lines and also play with the brightness and contrast so we 
can get a least amount of lines and also animate them all the time time into give a expression of time into 500 what it will do is uh, by for one second it will rotate for the 500 degrees that means 360 plus uh, 140 okay it will animate like this so by making uh, by going to color channel and make invert it so we can get the black and the white uh, like this so we need to multiply it what it will it will create a lines over the footage so it will make it will give a dust 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 scratches over the thing and also make a solid go to scratches make it scratches dust. now we're gonna make a dust make a new solid layer you can name it dust make it generate um, sorry noise and grain factor noise and uh, make a least amount of uh, clouds by adjusting contrast and brightness up to you can see some of the lines over the black like this you may increase it according to your need so here it is my final setting I hope you may see these uh, small patches over the thing ok and uh, right now we may to make another expression over the random seed go to random seed and click on Alt click on random seed so you can make an expression, uh, write an expression. Um, you need to give a random into 100. What it will make is for every frame, it will make a, uh, it will give a value between 0 to 100. From the, from the value to, if you if you put in five. If you put in into 100 here, it will be uh, it will be uh, randomized between 5 to 100. So make sure it will be in zero or as per your uh, setting. So sometimes you need. So we need to make it uh, uh, We need to invert it as uh, as the before as we did it before for the scratches. So we're going to channel and uh, use a invert and uh, put it into multiply so as you have see the footage will be displayed as a uh, old film look if you are uh, if you can if you want to make it you can make it up to 10 to 100 and uh, make it like this so you get a nice vintage look over the video you can give some effect of uh, like the uh, some 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 other effect like uh, you going to solid noise grain factory noise uh, this will be either light leaks or or light overlay we will, we will name it as a light overlay so let's see so I am going to make, uh, make it by going to transform with the spline mode and adjust the brightness to the like this and scale up to the six thousand sorry then make a
and make an evolution of uh, by giving expression of time into 500 like that. You may give it as a multiple or a multiply also. So you can see the and make an opacity to down. Like that. You may already understood uh, how uh, fractal lines will be used for so many effects. Um, I I didn't say this is the best effect uh, for this uh, uh, world film look, but please look after for, uh, my portfolio too. Uh, they are very useful. If you look at them, my, my ha I have lots of best sellers uh, in my portfolio. Please look after them. Uh, I hope you my you like my tutorial, guys. Uh, I will meet with uh, another fractal noise tutorial. I am making series of, uh, uh, as I am making a series of these uh, fractal noise templates. Please subscribe to the, my channel so you can get uh, every update uh, I am uploading. I hope you like this tutorial, guys. Bye.